Hello, ladies and gentlemen, it's a five minute burst of FTL with your host, the Marmoset. Yay, we squished the bug. Close the doors. Get some oxygen back in here. Alright, we should soon have, yes, swarm missiles. Please, for the love of anything that's sweet, get those shields down. Or not. Fine. Ah. Hit. Yes, finally. Bike beam. Shoot. All of the things. We got a hull breach? Or we got a hull breach on them? Sounds like we might have got a hull breach on them. Where did that go? Fire in the cloning bay. That's not the noise, that's a different noise. But we can at least vent that. Um, alright, let's make sure all, right, all the guns are off. You shoot that, you shoot that. I need the pipe beam to make its very way. Guns stunned. Close our doors and the fire is out. Bang. Done. Leave me behind yet more scrap material. Cool. What have we got? We picked up a firebomb, didn't we? 15 seconds. 16 seconds. Hmm. Do I swap that out for the ion blast? And then just keep dropping those in? No, I'm, I'm pretty happy with the, the uh, weapon set we've got at the moment. It's just the total lack of crew is not helping. Just was slow on everything more than anything else. Sell drone parts, yes. Merrily sell drone parts. Can't get to the store. Next sector. Rebel Stronghold or Zoltan. Let's head for the Zoltan. Oh, no. Their shields are going to make life even harder. Let's just see how far we can get. Let's snuggle our way through in the nebula and see what we can find. A scout. Automated scout. That is a lot of guns. Well, this is going to go badly, isn't it, ladies and gentlemen? Fire on that. Fire on that. It's a miss. Not much point in you firing if the thing guns aren't shields aren't slightly disabled. Yes, no, please hit that. Good. Swarm of three. Total miss. That landed. Just at the same time that that got hit, which means you've now got no charge. You also have no oxygen, so please try and do your best to fix that before it all goes horribly wrong. Well, the shields are down, but our hull is cracked. There we go, ladies and gentlemen. Thus ends Season 4. Let's have a look at our stats. With one last explosion marks your fate as your ship is torn apart. This is C-type for the tech type. So that was our, our new score. So apparently didn't get that much further when I tried it on easy last time. Uh, this session, 17 ships defeated, 51 beacons, 711 scrap. Q hired four, which is my starting crew. Um, we didn't get much more than that. Oh well. Oh dearie, dearie, me, dearie me. So that was a, a messy, messy fight. Screwed us a couple episodes ago there, ladies and gentlemen. So that ended that one. Let's head to the hangar. And just gently browse at some of the ships. Yeah, well, that's a lot of fun if you don't mind the fact that you just have to end up dodging. I mean, if you've got the cloak, it's not too bad. That one. Thesis. That's a Mantis ship, is it not? Or who's the, who's, what type of ship is this? Take no prisoners. Yeah, it's the Mantis variation. So what's this one got? Lock bombs, storm bombs, and a four-way thing. All right. We do start off with a, a uh, gold... Lannis, apparently. Draining oxygen. I know I like to stick these guys in a room where other people aren't ever likely need to go. They're great against boarding parties, but you need a pair of them. Mm, but yeah, having a quadruple boarding bay does make life a bit easier. This one, at least you have a couple more crew members to throw in your boarding bay. You just start with no guns. Yeah, it's not too bad. S-bomb, small bomb. Okay. Random. Random. The new ether. I don't know if I had a reasonable amount of fun with this one. Double ion blast, rapid fire on the pipe beam. Doesn't mean you get chew their shoes quite quickly and then you lace them all into oblivion. That's it, the halberd beam. It's a lot of fun. A lot of damage. Early days, because it does so much power, early does so much damage. It chews through a lot of shields, so early days you don't really need to worry about it too much. Because it basically makes an almighty mess out of pretty much anything. Alright, so, looks like we might be having a little bit of a, 
Hmm. I think before we start the next one, we're doing the usual thing. We're just going to randomly pick a thing for the next episode, but or a mission to start season five. I mean, we only got a few episodes in on this one before we died horribly due to me not pausing the game enough when a fight got really complicated with the boarding parties. All right, thank you very much for watching, Ezra. This has been a five-minute burst of FTL, and I have been the Marmoset. Please remember to like and subscribe.